Hey, it's David, or should I say Redcoin Hyper I205 here. So today, yes, I was not expecting to do this again, though, but I'm doing it again because, oh my fucking God. If you saw the AIS newspaper I wrote about Mike Boyer, that's exactly who I'm talking about today. So anyways, today I'm going to be talking about Michael Boyer, who I used to know him as Michael Productions or Michael Boyer to Smith Borderline Enterprises. If you don't know him, well, he, he's called Michael Boyer. And <laughs> to be absolutely fucking honest with you, you, I used to like him in my past, but I don't because I have seen what he's been doing recently. And and I hate to say this, but he's technically, he's technically acting like a criminal because there's... At first, I wasn't going to ignore. I was going to ignore him at first, but he sent he sent child porn. All right, he 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 sent child porn and and sexual remarks to to minors on Discord. Like, why would I forgive that? Why would I forgive that? Also, by the way, I'm about to invite Kim here or true true AIS members here. I can't do that to anyone that's in the live chat. Unfortunately, I hate to say that because, like I said. For true AEIS members only, e, I'm not making fun of people. I'm just saying the real truth and facts here. It's just that I can't invite anyone that is not a true AES, AEIS member that is not a Vanguard Plus. And yes, I'm, I'm doing this because, because of what he's been doing recently this week. And yes... Colin's right. He one time sent an uh, inappropriate threat to Sophie Cat, in which I don't know why would he do that though, but it is extremely true. And yes, there is evidence of him doing that though. And yes, I don't know why would he send that inappropriate threat, but it's true. <laughs> it's true. Oh, by the way, it's David though. And yes, I'm doing this because of. He even ran down the community, though. Well, I, the community doesn't matter, though. You no, know, look, people can like a dislike community. We all have communities that are a part of, but still, I don't want to be off topic. What he did was there was one screenshot that I found from from a Google album from Galaxy 2006, which is why he got reported, where he sent it an inappropriate threat to. He sent it an inappropriate threat to Sophie Cat and. One of the few other screenshots was like in some DM group that was like trolling him. Yeah, I believe it was trolling, in not like, yeah, I believe it was trolling or roasting or confronting him. I I think it was a trolling DM group, which even though I'm not a fan of making those DM groups, but I heard it was a trolling one. It was a trolling one. There was one of the few screenshots, and yes, I will send it in direct messages. There was one of the few of the screenshots where he actually said that he admitted that he was being a pedophile and a terrorist, like. I wasn't going to be part of his drama at first because he might. I thought he was going to look like an attention seeker, but I guess not since he sent it, since he sent it child porn and on Discord and, and and sexual remarks to to minors. He's eighteen, all right. He's a pedophile anyway. I hate to break it to you, but it's true. He's already a pedophile because he's. He sent he sent child porn on Discord and the and what and yes I'm being serious here. He sent child porn on Discord and that really and I, and the pics were censored because people did not want to be disgusted out. He and yes, I'm sorry I I'm sorry my brain's a problem right now. He sent he sent child porn on Discord. I don't know why would he do that though, but it's true. He actually sent a child porn on Discord, though, and I, which I don't know why would he do that, but it's true and disgusting. It's really disgusting how he did this. And uh, one of the other screenshots, yes, even Colin said this in the live chat. He threatened to stalk a mon he threat he threatened to stalk a sixty year six year old. <laughs> I'm not laughing. I'm not laughing. I'm being serious. Why would an eighteen? Why would I, why would he have to? Be, why would he ever do this? Why would he do this? I don't know. I thought at first I thought he was doing this to get to get your react to get someone's reaction, but he's 
he's not. He actually sent a child porn on Discord. So what I can say is, fuck ignoring him. Don't even ignore him because he sent a child porn on Discord. And, and he sent a child porn on Discord. And yes, he sent a child porn on Discord and sent sexual remarks to minors. I don't, I don't get it. I don't. I don't get it why he would do this type of stuff. If he was doing this on YouTube, then he, then he would have been terminated already. That is that is true, Redcoin. He would have been terminated. And I also I also realized that he was even sending raping threats to random people. Yeah, I don't get it. Why would he do that? I I, I, mean, I don't even get it. Why would he do that though? No, but it's insane. And her, and her, and her, and how old is Michael Boyer? He's like eighteen as of now. Eight, 18 and he acts like this. Yes, I'm yes. one. I'm, I'm I'm one year older than him, and I know way smarter than him. And yet he does this at the age of eighteen. What a fucking asshole he is. True, true. Worst count to try. How frustrating that is for me to make this. Yes, it's already putting me in frustration because why, like, like, why would you, why would he, I, I can't believe he would actually do this stuff and send inappropriate threats to minors. Like, I don't get it. I don't get it. it I'm not laughing though. I, I may sound like it though, but I'm not. It's true. It's really, it really is. He sent an inappropriate threat. He he threatened to stalk he threatened to stalk someone that is six years older than that is a six year old like old which as the live chat one of the there was one comment in the live chat saying that he actually threatened to stalk his six year old I don't understand why would you why would he threaten people that yes I'm actually younger than him and I know better than than to send these threats to people even if it's someone I may not like it, and sure I can dislike people for a reason. That does not mean you send these threats ever to people at all. So, so basically, what you're saying is Michael Boyer said he was going to stalk someone who who is only six years old, and yet he's eighteen. I guess so because there was a one comment from the live chat. I'll show you what I mean. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Can I um? Can I share my? Well, hello. Uh, can I share my screen about the the photos that you showed us in the private chat? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because yes, there, there is a Google Doc folder I have on my screen. Okay, so, ladies and gentlemen, this is Force Motor One speaking on behalf of the, the AEIS members. Welcome. Well, I would like to say thank you for letting me join. So, I'm going to be showing off a um, bit of a um, so some bit of some shocking things uh, that you may be seeing here. So, here's the first one. I'm just going to be going down very slowly around these things. So, he's admitting this right here. So, he, this, so he is, so he is admitting that he's a pedo. And then he also offended blacks here, and then, and, and that does, that's not an excuse. I mean, we're not even trolling him. I mean, what about, what the hell is this? Really? Now that is too far. And wow, I mean, I know there's a lot of people that hate me, but that the fact that I admit it, I admit that I started the Beatrice son of Lynick war. It's this user right here. I said that's oh wow, attack. wow! Imagine attacking someone like that. That's just too far. I did that so he can attack and sp expose you to death. Yeah, and then he also said this here, and oh, oh, God. ew! Really? Wow! What the fuck? Don't get me don't attacked. get me well, don't don't get me, don't <laughs> get me attacked my ass. I mean, yeah, bruh, moment. Ew! Wow. He, he is just. He is just. He. Don't forget the troll. Oh wow! Wow. Oh my! Oh my fucking god! Oh my god! Wow! And he was homophobic just now. That offends Adrian. Honestly, honestly, I'm not surprised that he's acting wow. homophobic. Wow, mo bra moment right here. What the fuck? The okay, how many? Okay, I'm after I see this, I'm gonna go back and see how many. T 
What the freaking heck is this? Wow. Wow. Ew. Wow. What the fuck is that a picture of? Yeah, it's like... Bruh. Bruh. Go... That's just too much. How How is this? Okay, seriously. Okay. Uh, wow. Imagine doing that when you're 18. That is too far. And... Oh my god. Lin... Oh, so this is how Lindsay... Well, I mean, I hate Lindsay because he does the same, but that's just ridiculous. Bruh. This, this is way too far. And this way... Right Wait, go up, go up. The reason why I sexually harassed Queen Maddie, be Queen Maddie because her breasts are so big and she is S-word. Ew! I know, right? But, wow. Wow. And, and, and imagine... A and imagine whacking someone who gave Adrian a blue skin of death in his I, 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 if I If I was hearing this, I would be taking my earbuds off immediately because this is messed up. I know, right? I'm, this okay. is so fucking disgusting and gross okay, as hell. I'm gonna go back to how many times he, he was doing these threats. So I'm gonna go I'm gonna go start from the top and I'm gonna count how many times he did these um these R threats. So let's see. One Two, three. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, four, five, six, uh, seven. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. Eight. So eight of these threats right here are just are just been exposed by Michael Boyer. This is just for this is ridiculous. Wow. Just I know, right? That is really messed up. To be honest, what what kind of what kind of what was he even thinking by sending those threats? I mean. Always accomplishing is just beginning to become more hated on than ever before. And if you don't, you don't and if you don't know, and if people still like him, they probably just don't know what he's doing. That's, that's they're probably they're saying. probably they're probably unaware at this point. Yeah, right so if here. anyone if anyone has not seen what Michael's done and they still like him, please do not go after them for that because that's just going to waste your time. And, and you're also, and you're and you're just going to make things worse in the process. Exactly. Okay, this is the comment I found when I mentioned where he said he was threatened to stalk a six-year-old. I, I that's what that's what that's the that's the proof that was just shown by Foolish a few minutes ago. It, it his one of his comments literally said that he was a stalker and that he stalked and that he tried stalking a little girl. Yeah, that that that, that that's way too far. I mean, and and doing that to someone that young on the internet is just way that is. That is beyond. I mean, I'm I'm even face palming. You can even you can even tell I'm just face palming right now because of this. Yeah, it's just it's just so messed up. It it's just so messed up and very sick of him in the head. Hello, EMD. Uh, yeah. yeah, I mean, I, I mean, yeah, I mean, I'm you, it, that's messed up. That really is. I, oh, I don't yeah. blame oh, anyone. Yeah. This is messed up. Oh yeah. Speaking. Yeah. Of, oh yeah. Speaking of that. Do you also want to know something else that Michael Boyer has done? He actually did this to me. He actually did this to me back back in October 2020. What did he do? So so last year in October, I gave I gave him advice for his videos because because he was because he was uh, not being civil a lot in his videos, even though many other people have done that. But I was all, but I'm mostly referring to the way he takes DM groups out of people. He. Um, he wasn't saying that they were a problem on Discord, but the but the truth is he was not being civil, which means he was basically he was basically acting just like Amanda Rose and Moonlight Mimi for a for a brief example. Yeah, I mean, and yeah, him too. He was not being civil, so I gave him advice and told and told him um, how how he should be civil in DM groups, and then he just told me that he has all that he has all rights to not be civil, and then he just started attacking me over me giving him advice. Oh my freaking god. How does he have rights? 
you're not you're let me get the let me just look you straight in the eyes michael let me just look you straight in the eyes how do you have rights let me explain this how do you have rights you're not the most you're not the most important person in the world you're not like you're not someone that needs to be taken as like the biggest person in the internet who should be who should be treated with respect you're not one of those there are people out there that deserve that deserve to have equal amounts of support so so get this michael you having rights that's bull crap bull crap i just i just written I just, I just refer, I just refer that as bullshit to Michael Boyer. I mean, he literally, I mean, his, I mean, I even remember the whole thing his reply said. I mean, what I commented is that you should actually, you should actually be civil to people instead of just, instead of just going after them, unless if they did very serious things. And then he said, I have, I have all right. I have all rights to go after people, even if they did serious things or not, because what, because, because what they, because if they did very serious things, they cannot be forgiven. So let me do whatever the fuck I want. And then, and then he just sent, and then some of his fans just started attacking me and then he started attacking me. Wow. And also, um, when did, what, um, what is this I'm hearing from Alexander? He's saying that Michael Boy acquitted using discord. Um, uh, was that true? He was actually he was actually using Discord back in uh, back in 2020. I mean, I had him as a friend on Discord in November 2020. I mean, I had him as a friend in November 2020 after after he gave up on attacking me for like three fucking weeks. He decided to apologize to me, which I which I believed he was being sincere. So that's why I friended him. But then back in January, I immediately unfriended him because of everything I just saw and the fact and the fact how he was acting so immature in his fucking videos. I mean, here's the thing, too. Um, like, I mean, Michael Boyer, I mean, how long has he been known for doing these things for? That's the thing. And the fact that he's basically, he's basically, he's basically been known to do most of these things in 2021, to be honest. Okay. So, 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 bas so basically he's been known to do most of these things th throughout this year, which we're almost uh -huh. to the end of this year anyway, since yeah. we have less than two months before we start 2022. Yeah. yeah. I hope 2022 is honestly better because 2021 for our community. Just we're good. I, would, I mean, I mean, I mean, to be, to be fair here, 2021 has just been filled with people turning into pedophiles and shit. I know. Right. Well, here's the thing in the real world. 2021 actually wasn't as bad as 2020 was, but in our community, definitely agreed. Definitely. Yeah, agreed. yeah, yeah, yeah. Community-wise, for this year has just been filled with pedophiles. We've been going into multiple wars trying to get trying to get them to, trying to get them to leave the fucking internet. Yeah, it's been like that. But as far as the real world goes, it actually has not been too bad. I'll say that. Yeah. Honestly. Uh -huh. Cause COVID, COVID was done for like we were going back to re we were going back to the way we were, um yeah. I still have just, to work, just, re just remember, COVID is still out there. Sure. It is, but at the same time, it's getting better because I remembered um last year in December 2020 there was a massive COVID surge. We got over we I remember one day we got over fifty thousand cases of COVID nineteen in my home state. And we and when and when the and when the COVID nineteen got really bad at at I'd say the start of twenty twenty, uh the uh the, the COVID nineteen got so bad um when it when it when it reached all fifty states that that the total number of cases for just the United States was over one million. Uh yeah, I'm I'm looking it up right now. Let me let me see. Holy shit. I'm not. I'm not even. I'm not even joking, Red Coin. When the COVID nineteen started to spread all over the U.S., the U.S. literally confirmed that there were over one million cases confirmed of COVID. Wow. That's my country. Yes, yeah, the U.S. Yeah. yeah, the the U.S. is also my country too. That's my country. Like the. Oh my goodness! This is why I. This is why my life in 2020 was awful because. That's my country. Why are you going to infect my country with, with? Why are you going to infect so many people in my country with a very terrible disease? Oh, wait till you hear this. the The day after Christmas, we had um. Uh, it says on my phone that the the the, the, the statistics say that 
the day after Christmas was the highest number of cases in the U.S., which was 64,986 new cases. With a seven Jesus day Christ. That's and with my a seven country. Yeah. And also with these COVID jokes, too. I mean, imagine imagine that. I mean, yeah. And then as far as deaths go, um, I'm, that's only for cases. Let me see how deaths were back then. Those I mean, I mean, I mean, the, I mean, the COVID jokes were basically started by Selena when she decided to joke about having COVID last year on April Fool's Day in 2020. And then after she did it, um, Sierra TLFYT, which we all know is a sock puppet made by Caleb Animate, decided to do the same bullshit. Well, here's the thing. Caleb. I wouldn't blame. I wouldn't. I wouldn't think of C, of, of Selena as someone who whose fault it is because, to be honest, someone else probably could have done it. E even if it wasn't Selena, it could have been someone else. Well, well, that is true. I mean, you do you do prove a point there. To be honest, I'm not saying Selena should have should have done that, but at the same time, well, I mean, and plus that was like over a year ago. She's been forgiven by a lot of people. So I know. I know. Yeah, and plus she's no longer in our community anyway. She's more, she's doing gotcha. She's only, now. she's only into gotcha now. Yeah, well, I mean, yeah, I'm in both this and gotcha at the same time. I'm not in the community because of its toxicity, but at the same time, yeah. I'm, I'm still, I'm still in this community, the, the, the GoAnime community. I, I'm meaning, I'm, I'm talking about gotcha. Oh, still, oh yeah. But still, yeah, but still, but still, I mean, I, I, mean, but still, I, I don't hate gotcha in a way. Of course. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm only in the GoAnime community mostly. I'm, I'm, I mean, I've mostly been staying out of the Gacha community due to the toxicity, and not only just the toxicity of the Gacha community, but also, but also, also the disgusting things that have been on Gacha. For it, for example, for example, those Gacha heat videos, they're so fucking gross. Yeah, I don't do any of those Gacha crap videos. I, yeah, I, we're, we're, I mean, yeah, we're, yeah, we're, yeah, we're because of that, that people even are attacking users for using gotcha. It's like, it's like, it's like gotcha isn't even an opinion anymore to them. And this, and this Michael Boyer person, um, do you remember these, do you remember these scenes where he was using like people that had the word agency? I don't even know what type of version that is. I don't know either, honestly. I wish I, I knew what type of version that is because honestly, the way the way Michael Boyer was using that type that type of expression or that type of those type of people in his message videos or anything that just seems so that just seems so fucking cringeworthy cringeworthy exactly. in my thoughts. Yeah, it seems fucking cringe. Hi, SG and everyone else who uh, just came. Hi to those in the live chat and yes. About gacha though, even though this 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 podcast is not about gacha, I've never used gacha to begin with, but some people do make my avatar in gacha, and I'm absolutely fine with that. There's there's, a, a, there's, there's there's one there's one specific reason as to why I do not use gacha. It's not it's not it's not, be, it's not because it's not because I find it bad. It's it's the it's the it's the, it's the fact how people are mostly getting attacked just for using it. Yeah, yeah. I'm one of those. I mean. I, I hardly get attacked for it, but there's this one user named Light Blue who always goes after cr people for using gotcha and call and like I've tried being civil and all that with them. Gotcha. Like, like what's the point of being against people all because they use gotcha? It's not even that big of a deal. It's just an app game, man. Um, I this is gotta... this is this is this is why I don't even use gotcha because I mean I mean I could roast those people who are tr who are just acting like babies and such just for using gotcha, but most of the Look time I just most of Look the time I just decide not, not to fuck. I just decide not to use it because I because I don't because I don't I don't want these people attacking me just for just for using something they don't like. Look at yeah, that. Like... Look at this. I, mean, I saw that. Like what the what the fuck. And also, of course, it's Wow Wow Lulu who's doing this. I mean, why? I told Lulu specifically, stop doing these DM groups, and he ignores me. This is Look this is why this is why this is one reason why I blocked him on my other Discord account, which you is my what? computer I, account. I, I had to refriend him. Temp I had to refriend him so I could be added to a to a DM group. But mm. you know what? I'm I'm done with him. I blocked him again. Yeah, like what's the point of I, making after this DM after. Group? 
after I blocked him, I just kept him blocked, and I'm never going to unblock him because I because of how many because I how because of how many times he does the he does the groups. I mean, every time he does the groups, he's never civil, and he always start he always starts drama against someone, even if even if they did a minor mistake. Here's a good example. Look at this. I bet Michael Boyer was upset because Justin Bieber won't let lo him. I mean, what uh, what kind of a joke is this? I mean, he does these stupid Devin. jokes all the time. That literally, that literally makes no sense. It's like he does these jokes just to target them more and more and get the reaction they want. He That's always he thing. always does that. He's known to do that most of the time. Exactly. And I mean, I'm happy. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, I I I do you know why with Lulu though. Like he's very annoying. He like begs people to like. Like, see this type of drama image of what this 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 person has done insanely wrong. But the thing is, what's the point of involving people into pointless drama? If it, if I mean, if someone wants to stay out of drama, they have it. They have the they have the right to stay out of it. I mean, most of the, most of the time, what they would say is that if they if they don't want if they if they don't want to be involved in a drama um, that's unnecessary or shit, they. They can they can literally stay out of it all they want. I mean, they they would normally just say, "Keep me out of this situation, or I'm staying out of it." But then, but then, but then some of the but then some of these dumbasses always feel the need to you know add still add them into these fucking trolling confronting groups or may, mostly trolling. I would say mostly trolling groups, and they're just getting they're just they're just still getting them involved into this fucking drama, even when they want to stay out of it. And and then and then it just escalates more shit, and it just escalates more shit from there. Exactly, and um, yeah. If any of you guys like Lulu, it's fine. He isn't. He isn't like. Uh, he isn't like a major bad person. Um, I, of course, I know. I, I I I can understand opinions, but just know that if well, I'm gonna say this. Um, Lulu is also known. Speaking of begging, for always begging. His friend, like I'm gonna say this. Um, let me um, let me actually um, pull up a DM, Big Cookie, because I gotta show you this. Mm, let me let me. Okay, so okay. Um, if you don't mind, of course, let me explain about Lulu a little bit in a DM that I'm in. So, uh, so let me pull up Discord right here. It's uh it's on the screen share you can see. Um I'm sorry. Um, okay, okay, okay. Uh so in this DM here, I'm gonna search for Lulu right here. Let me search Lulu. So Lulu. Enter. Try again, but Lulu is asking me if you care about him. Lulu wants you to join your Halloween server. Lulu is joining, but I don't think you'll talk that much. Yeah, he's this is Lulu, basically. It's like it's like Lulu wants to stalk me because this is seriously was like um. Uh, let me actually. I'm just gonna search the relevant tab. If okay, seriously. Well, that's still. just the perfect example of acting very annoying. And yeah, yeah. It's like Lulu is asking if you care about him. I don't. I don't care because he seriously does not stop. What? Like like imagine giving people pointless drama for absolutely nothing. And let me um now go to Collins DM quickly right up here. Lulu. And I need an index. Okay. Lulu and yeah, this is something here. Lulu advice on how to comfort users right away. If not, that's okay with that. Yeah, I mean seriously. It's like he's—he's he's like he's stalking me, and I cannot take his—I cannot take it anymore. I and, get a headache. And beside me, I'm and even besides, having a headache talking about him at this point. And besides, do you want to know something else about him? What? I told—I told—I told, I told him one time. To, I told him one time to keep me out of a drama I did not want to be involved in. And guess what he did? He added me into that trolling group and got me involved in that fucking drama. Even after I told him to, even after I told him. To keep me out of it. Oh my god, get a brain for God's sake. Yeah, so yeah, so Wawa Lulu, I mean, I do apologize if this is off topic since this is mostly about Michael Boyer, but still, well, Wawa I mean, Lulu, still. 
seriously, kind of started because of him. Well, seriously, Walla Lulu, do you did you seriously have to involve me into that drama even after I told you? I, I told you specifically on DMs to keep me out of that drama, and yet you still got me involved in it. And even after I left that group, you just kept adding me back because you because you wanted me to be involved in this drama, and you and you thought and you thought I would you thought I would do some of the best things to get rid of that person, but I told you to keep me out of it, and you disobeyed me. Yeah. It's just it's just so fucking ironic how he how he how he constantly kept on getting me involved into certain dramas that I wanted to stay out of. Yeah, I know, right? It's and it's just it's just so fucking ironic. And and consider and considering the fact that Wawa Lulu, remember when he started that drama against Kim on August fifteenth just because he was complaining that Kim blocked him? Yeah. That, I remember. I remember got, that happened on August fifteenth, and he got three users mainly involved that they were almost hated on because of him. Exactly. I it was, do I, remember I, that. I mean, I mean, the the way that was actually the, the first ever AEIS stream I actually joined because I remember that Matthew actually made a stream about that, and I was actually the first stream I joined about it. Yeah, yeah, and I was joining every other stream since I was already a true AEIS member before that. I, I wasn't was then, but I was, I was a cadet, so I think I, I was basically I was basically joining all the podcasts that are and all the podcasts are done by Alex. Yeah. Yeah, Alex. And besides, besides, um, uh, the the current the current role I have for the AEIS is a candidate. Yeah. Yeah, I'm actually fourth cooperative commissioner at commissioner already. Yeah, well, and, well, the, well, the re well, the reason why you won is be is because um they said that they said that you won the fourth uh, cooperative commissioner when because of how many news reports you were you were able to send out on the, on the AEIS news. Yeah. yeah, I was I was like the only one to send out AEIS news report while the others were not even doing it. Besides Corey, well, I mean, like Corey, Corey did some too. Well. Well, well, I would, I would have done some of them too, but the only thing is, I did not have access to it. Yeah. And plus, don't yeah. forget your computer. That's, a, yeah. that's the, that's the, that's the reason why I was not able to do news reports. If I, if I actually, if I actually had access to do news reports, then I, then I, then I would have done some of them myself. Uh, I, I can actually do that. I'm mostly the one who does that. Well, well, yeah, well, yeah, because you have access to it. Well, yeah. I mean, here's the thing, too. I mean, like, um, yeah, yeah. There's some people that want to. There's some people that do want to join the thing, yeah. But let's get back to our topic. So, what else should yeah. we mention about Michael Boyer and what he's done? Have Have any of you guys ever, like? Well, I well, remember, remember, remember the trolling streams that were mostly made out of King Liam back back in uh, last year. Well, um, I wasn't in Discord back then, and I do remember that someone uh, that um, I think it was Kim made a, a funny like. Um, I think some people she were she made she Discord. made a, she made a video roasting King Liam when he was on Adrian's stream, which was the truth stream he did out of. Out of that Vidrin person last year, which was back in August. Oh, Vid. Oh, Vidrin. Yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. That's the. That's the time. What? That's the time when Kim uploaded that video, even though she said that she had to. She had to delete that video because of personal reasons. Eh, it's fine, honestly. And plus, King Williams are good now, so it's fine. Anyways. Yeah, um, but yeah, but anyways. Well, um, back to the topic. That I was going to, I was going to, I was, this is still on topic of what I'm going to say further about it. But go ahead. Okay, so, okay, so I remember Adrian doing a stream once in October where he was roasting King Liam. And here's the thing, Michael Boyer was on that stream. And I, I'm telling you, trolling, trolling is oh, not the same. Of Adrian, he's right tro here. Trolling is not the, trolling is not the same as being civil. But Michael Boyer was just fucking attacking this kid. He wasn't. He wasn't even. He wasn't even giving him the chance to say anything. And, and Michael Boyer just said, "Michael, Michael Boyer just said, is this King Liam kid fucking high or something? It just makes no fucking sense." And I don't it, and even. He, I don't even care about the King Liam drama either. I don't even care about his like, um, And I would. Yeah, and I would. And I would mention. And, no joke. And Adrian. And Adrian. I was mentioning about your trolling stream you made out of him last year in October, but I was mentioning part of Michael Boyer's doing there because that's what the topic of the stream is about. 
Okay, I have something I would like to address about Michael Boyer. So go ahead. So basically, um, <clears throat> so like back in 2020, like back in October 2020, like yeah. So basically, he yes, of course, he's the culprit of of making my drama worse. And yes, and. Because of that, he also, I don't know what he did, but he even exploiting pedophilia during that time. The, eviden the evidence was shown on the screen share from Foolish about that uh, near the beginning of the stream. And yeah, so basically, uh, back in October 2020, 2020 uh, during around my drama, uh, Michael Boyer even shipped uh, a 14-year-old to an 18-year-old, which it counts as exploiting pedophilia. That is definitely considered pedophilia. He shouldn't have done that. So, yeah. And also, don't, do you know what's funny? What? I, I can't... Even though this is not part of the... Even though this is not part of the trolling, but... I might have... I meant to say this, but Michael Boyer even, uh, you know got in trouble by his parents and the VC, and I heard it. Wait, he got in... He, he, what? He got in trouble like back by in his parents 20, in... Back in, in last year, call? yeah. Last year, yeah. <laughs> he honestly deserved it. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I cannot believe this literally happens. Like, I don't know what happened. I, I don't know how, though, but it's he got drunk by his parents when he was in a voice call. It's kind of embarrassing, though. That's true. If you, yeah. If you forgot your mic, if you if you forgot your microphone, if you forgot to mute your microphone uh, while you, you were in trouble, then that may sound embarrassing. And it, and it, may, and it, and it also may be disturbing to uh, younger people as well. Yeah. Yeah. And, and and uh, Adrian, before you got here, the evidence that Foolish showed, um, Michael Boyer is definitely confirmed to be a pedophile. Not because he, not because he was doing false shipping, but here's another thing: he also he also he was also mentioning that he even stalked a six year old, and he said that he he said that he even he said that he even raped someone before. One in one in your right, in God's name, would he ever do something such a thing like this? That is not no, right? something that you should ever do in your life like this. Like, and he, and he, and he even, and he even admitted that he was an actual pedophile. And even worse, um, even further on there, he even, he even, he even did a sexual role play with someone because what he, because one of the things he said was "suck my d word," and he even said that he, that he put his, that he put his fucking dick in someone's mouth. Like here, here's one more thing. I'll I'll take this as an example though, but if I mean if if I see you know Michael Boyer in real life literally touching and literally stalking my thirteen year old younger sister, then I'm gonna beat his ass. And trust me, if I ever if I ever if I ever saw him trying to if I ever if I ever saw him trying to do anything to my girlfriend Cyan Diamond Rage, he would he would serious he would seriously he would seriously get get some of the get some of the biggest backlash I would ever give him. Yeah, my microphone is like I don't know why the sorry about that. I have uh microphone it, issues with volume. The, so yeah. The, also uh is the signal bad in your area or something? Because because like, Mike yeah. mic issues mic issues can also be caused by low signal. Literally, yeah. I'm using my microphone that stands up normally. Yeah, I see. Yeah. Honestly, I think I don't have a problem with my mic though. I've had problem. I've I've had problems with my mic on my computer. So even yeah. But anyways, my computer is still under fucking repair, and it, and this has been little. I mean, they have had my computer for twelve fucking days. I'm back. Um, the reason That's, why I was gone for so long was because I had to get my um, I had to get my spare keyboard because the the one that I that I mostly use is needing uh, a big clean. So I'll I'll show you guys like. 
if you could tell, um, this is the one I'm, I, I usually use. Um, it's really dusty right now, so I have to, I'm going to have to clean it. So for now, I'm using my backup one. <laughs> and yes, well, at least, well, at least you have the backup keyboard. It's not as cool as that one. It doesn't flash, but I'll show you. It looks like this. Yeah. It's, it's pretty cool, though. Yep. So, <clears throat> and yes, I have that AIS flag in, as its one. background. Since this is an AIS podcast, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh my Let God. Let me search up Michael Boyer. He's Michael Boyer. Just I don't. I don't even. I don't, I don't he's don't formerly know known him. as. He's formerly known as Michael Productions. Yes, I actually do remember him when he was Michael Productions. I know him. Since since I remember was, that too. Since back him, in when like when Lulu made that group out of it, Lulu still sucks because of him starting drama against Kim back in August. I actually do remember that though. I mean, yes, I may seem off topic though, but still. Like, Kim had, like, a few dramas against her, like, few times. One in August, thanks to Wala Lulu, and there was another drama against her because of um, uh, Duchess. I, I I think he, apo he was apologetic about it, he was making up false info about her by saying that she was defending Flipno Anime DePito when that wasn't even true, even though I, he may have regretted it, but still. Oh my God. I don't know what. <laughs> like, uh, I felt sorry for Kim having like two dramas against her in one in like yeah. uh, one, a month after month. Yeah. Yeah. Same. Like, like first she had, she had drama against her thanks to Wild Lulu, and then the other one was because of Duchess the Sponge saying making a false info by saying that she was defending a pedophile called Flip No Anime. But the thing about that is, that's not even true. He had Besides, no evidence to back it up. Yep. Besides, she knows better to defend terrible people online anyway. Exactly. Yeah. She would she would she would never she would never defend pedophiles. Yeah, exactly. That's also one of the few reasons why she was starting to have suicidal thoughts. Because I saw well, some kind well, of be, well, it, well, she, well, she was, uh, she was also crying a lot too. Because if you remember that drama that happened against her on, against her on August fifteenth, when she was getting attacked just because she blocked Wawa Lulu on Discord, uh, when everyone, when most, when most of these people were attacking her, uh, she was, she was crying a lot and. And wonder and wondering why people were just wasting their time attacking her. Yeah, all because of stupid Lulu. Like she has good reasons to block Lulu, you know. Exactly. Yeah. Like first of all, he is annoying by constantly getting people into unnecessary involved into unnecessary drama. Like people don't need to be involved in it because of how unnecessary it really is. Exactly. If they if they want to stay out of it, they have all rights to stay out of it. Yeah, and you're no one's boss. You're no one's adult guardian. You're no one's parent at all. Oh, I hate to be off topic though, but but it's true. I'm literally am laughing my ass off because of not laughing because uh, you know honestly the video what Michael Boyer made vote for Michael video. What do you think of that video? Vote for Michael. What the fuck? I think who would he, who would even who would even vote for a pedo like him? I'm not gonna That's vote so him. Stupid. I'm not gonna vote him. There's no, there's no, there is absolutely, there is absolutely no way I am voting for that fucking pedo. Yep. Same. I would never vote for him anyway since he's not even good anymore. Exactly. He's not good at all. He's not good he would, at all. He was, he was never a good person to begin with. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm eating lemon pepper. Tastes good. 
pepper. Yeah, lemon pepper. It was from chicken I got from Wawa. Okay. I think you've been to Wawa before. I I have I have been to that place before. There's there's a Wawa about fifteen minutes from my house. Yeah, I'm back. All right, welcome back, foolish. Who's who now? Who is taking my place over as a moderator? <laughs> yep. And yes, oh my god. Okay, here's a story of how I was able to write on the AI's newspaper. I explained to Corey about what Pinkstone's done, and I was thinking about putting her on the AI's news, but I couldn't. I thought I couldn't do it, and. He said, I can. It's just I had to get some photo. I use Photoshop for this, by the way. I had to get Photoshop to do it and take everything out with the instructions that's on there because the instructions can block the way that was that's in the way. Like, do not write so big at all. It has to be in the full sentence. Like, if you're writing on a real, real paper, right, without grammar mistakes. And the other is remove that with the grayscale pictures and, and the date, time, and year and written. Remove that written by your username. So that's what I did. My first one was about Pinkstone back in September. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But yes, I'm no. I'm yes. I'm. I seem like I'm off topic though. But I'm just explaining a story of how I was able to do. I was able to do it. Okay. Yeah, that's just a story, though. What is this about with Lulu now, Colin? Okay, anyways, right. Uh, okay. Oh, I was wondering. I was. I was actually thinking about this since we've known a lot about Wawa Lulu. Has any Has anyone ever thought about doing a stream about him on this AEIS channel? Um, I'm, I'm not sure. Uh, sure, sure. I guess. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean. I don't know. If I, I mean, I don't. I mean, I don't know if it's necessary. I mean, I mean, I would also want to. I mean, I would also. I would also want to make sure if if Corey and Alex are okay with this. Yeah. Just tell you though. To tell you though, I wouldn't. I wouldn't try to though. I wouldn't recommend it anyway. In my in my opinion though, I'm not saying that this is. This is bad or good though. I'm just saying it in my opinion. I wouldn't try it though. I I, I mean yeah. I I mean I never I never said that anyone was planning to do it. I, w I just had I just was thinking about that. If any if anyone if any one of us as AEIS members even thought about doing that. Yeah. If if Alex or Corey says yes, then if you want to or go ahead, then go ahead do it. Why don't we? If they don't, then don't do it. All right. Like if they said yeah. yes, why don't we just make this stream it too? Because we're hard. Because we're hardly talking about Michael right now. So we could also do that. Michael, Cole, <laughs> Cole. Kind of, kind of reminds me of the Cole person from that Dora show. Even though, even though Dora's show is fucking garbage. Yeah. Cole. Yep. Cole. Mike. Cole. Mike. 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 Cole Boyer. Michael Boyer. Mike. Michael Boy. Boy. Boy, boy, boyer. <laughs> Michael Boy. Michael Toyer. Michael Toyer. <laughs> uh, um, yes. I don't know. Yeah, Christian Christian said, is AI to need next holocord? Well, I don't know. I doubt that. Holocord is Holocord. Yeah, Holocord. And, it, and, a, and AEIS is AEIS. Yeah, yeah, because they do different things. First of all, AEIS investigates drama to see what is absolutely true without jumping into conclusions. The Holocord is meant to be against criminals. Dangerous, yeah. serious criminals. Yeah. Exactly. Well, I mean, the Holocord is, is good, too, in a way. Yeah, they're pretty good. That's why they... Yeah, they're pretty good. Yeah, they're they're quite good. Yeah. There's also my old friends there a long time ago, so yeah. Old friends? Also, 
Also, um, Adrian, if you want to use my Thanksgiving look, um, you ask Freddy because he has the hex for them. Okay. Right, just thought I'd have I also, I also have my Thanksgiving look right here on the profile, which was also made by Freddy. If you're wondering. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry if it's off topic. Yeah. Yeah. I do like the layer. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, well, not, well, the, yeah. well, the truth, Video well, the game. truth is foolish. Uh, Freddie said that this is basically the only Thanksgiving layout that can be found on Rapper. Ah, uh, yeah, and I then, smell. Yeah, and the thing is too, you can't tell what pants we're using. So I'm just saying, maybe just use black for mine, or, or unless he already showed it. Yeah, just being honest, though, you know. Uh, and yes, two days later. Two days later, and oh my god, I'm quite good with these AIs podcasts about users now. Like I'm getting used to it, you know. Yeah. Like back then, I couldn't do it about Pinkstone because Adrian would have to do it for me before I before they before Corey even pushed me to fourth corporate commissioner anyway. Yeah, and and guess and guess what? Adrian was able to do it. Yeah, yeah. Like back then, I would need someone's help to do it for me. But now that now now since Corey pushed me into that to Ford Carver Commissioner, they allowed me to do it, or he allows me to do it. Actually, scary Michael. Scary Michael. Michael ain't, is is like is too scared to deal with us now because of this truth. I think is yeah, that, yeah, that, that is something? true. Is he online on Discord or something? I might have to check because last time he was online. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if he's online because I do not have him friended. And don't forget, don't forget that Michael is also is also Islamophobic against in- Islams. He he definitely I, is. <sighs> Even though I'm I'm Catholic, but he, he kind of offended me. Yeah. Oh, I don't. I. Oh, I also, Adrian. Did you um? Uh, did you by any chance check out the stream earlier? Uh, because what like stream? Um, this one. So. I showed some um, evidences of what Michael did, um, but if you didn't see it, I can show it again. And plus, for anyone that hasn't seen it yet. So, also, um, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'll write quite the screen share if that's okay. So, um, I'm going to show you um, some of these um, evidences here. So, she admits right here this, as you can see. A terrorist? A terrorist? Jesus. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I know. And then he oh. also, he was he was admitting all of this. And how are we trolling you? How? We were only giving you backlash for all the shit you caused. Damn, okay. Michael. Damn, this is too far. That that is very and offensive. That is very this offensive is one to someone eight religion. times he, This is actually one of eight times he said something like this. No joke. Jesus said, fucking Christ! I know. I had a feeling that he's what well, he's gonna what's he's gonna offend next. Oh, uh, oh, and he started the war with Beatrice, even though I still trust her. I know some people don't, but it's okay. I'm oh, still friends wait. with Beatrice ever since like back in 2019. Oh wow! And and seriously, right here, look at this. He openly admits that he likes it. Like, what the fuck, dude? Jesus. Yeah, and, you and, he even, of... and he even and he even admitted that he also he even said that he also liked he also admitted that he liked child porn. And look at this one here. Are you kidding That's me? Fucking illegal. Wow. This right here. Is he that trying is... to get himself arrested or something like that? Yeah, I know. Oh well, guess what? He just friend box now. Wow. What's what is? No this? one wants to be friends with this idiot. Nope. No, He's no one loser. in their life. What a loser he is. What anyway. the hell, really?
Up. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Well, he just admitted this again, I see. <laughs> oh my gosh. He, re he really knows how to admit things that he's actually done. And look at this. This is exactly what we're talking about. What's he's gonna what's he's gonna offend next? I, I had a feeling that he's gonna offend people with autism. Yeah. If he if he actually oh, does it, Oh guess what? He, he just admitted you now, Adrian. I, look right here. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. That's okay. He now he literally offended one of he literally offended Matthew's boyfriend right now, including me and uh Red Coin. What? And look, he even he even said, "I'm not this," and then he said it. He said he was right after. Make it like seriously. Wow! Oh, this, wow! This make is up, too make far. Make up your fucking mind, Michael. Make up your motherfucking ah, mind. I don't know what is it with him, but this is insane. It is. He has gone way too and far. I, I mean, honestly, worry if I could write I this down to AIS News, wow, and he no, said, "What? What he just said to an Egyptian here? That's just too well, much." To be fair, Jesus, I will, I that's wish, way over the you line. You know, there. you know what? I I, will, I wish Keemstar might actually seize this. Oh my gosh! What yeah, the and, hell? And all of me to tell you this, I did ask Corey if it was okay if I could write if I would could write Michael Boy on the AIS news down, and he said yes, go ahead, and if I go wanted to. That. So I did. Wow, and, that's wow. good. Look at this one here. Are you kidding me? These two. Are you fucking kidding me? What and, the uh, fuck? I'm not happy with that. You can tell I'm not tolerating this. this Neither not, am I. This is unacceptable. This really is. This is so unacceptable. Like, this is so unacceptable. <laughs> I may sound like I'm laughing, but I'm not. I'm laughing angrily because is it's 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 it sucks. And no, just because wow. I'm laughing, I'm just because I'm laughing angry, that does not mean I'm. I find it funny. I'm just laughing angrily because I just seriously c cannot tolerate what he's done. I mean, look at I this cannot, one I here. cannot tolerate it either. Look at this one here. You can see right here. That is just too much. That's just wow. too far. That is way too far right there. there. Even and though I hate the Z Brown moment. That's too that's far from it. Wow. Wow. Oh my gosh. And look Damn. at him. He did this to him. Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. Bruh, look at this one now. That is too way too far. For real. I'm really offended. I'm starting to feel wow. offended, but I'm sorry. Wow. He literally I'm, a, I'm pretty I'm pretty offended by this too. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I yeah. I'm sorry to have to offend I'm sorry to have to have that as a result, because yeah, being from someone, you know. I can't believe yeah, you did that. I know. Let right? me tell you though, I, I actually do have autism though, and yes, when I was speaking to my grandmother, she actually did say that I have autism, and my my autism is like is really high though. That's why. Okay, I have an update regarding the Lulu thing. So, even though Lulu still said that to him in there, he wasn't the host. It was um. Uh, let me see. Where's ah? Uh -huh. It was um. It was someone about it. Oh, it was um. It was not Caleb the Half-Life editor, but it's someone else. And of course, oh, great, Molly was in this. So yeah, it was Caleb the Goat Knight something, whatever. Yeah, that made this. It wasn't ah. Lulu. Oh my but god. Still, Lulu's, Lulu's still annoying as it is. Yeah, I still do not like Lulu anyway because he just involves people to, into unnecessary dramas that, that really are because of how unnecessary they really are. And this and this is and this is why I refer to him as the king as the king of increasing drama, yeah. the king of false confrontations, confrontations and and, and the asshole that give Kim, that was that was that made Kim cry and gave her she, gave her terrible drama back in August. Like exactly. first she had to get deal with drama back in August and then in September. How much? To, that's way too much torture. That is true. 
Um, I want to give a very quick shout out to Christian Pinello for giving the AEIS a shout out. So thank you to Christian for doing that. I'll, yeah, thank you for that, Christian. Just a very quick shout out. Sorry to go off topic, but yeah, I just got, I just checked my notifications and I saw that he gave a shout out to the crew. He, he even, sh he, he gave everyone a shout out. He gave, he gave Corey, Alex, Redcoin, Matthew, me, him, and Adrian and VGP a shout out. And yeah, the, also the channel. All the members of the AEIS. Yeah. yeah. AEIS for life. AEIS for life. Yep. AEIS for life, boys. I Oh, you know what we should do? We should actually make a hashtag called AIS for life. Yeah, that is true. Now, that would be good. Yeah. yeah, we should just make a. We should make a. We should like. We should honestly like make a hashtag like that. And and yes, there is a DM group with the AIS AIS private plans discussion. Though it's a DM group. Though, if Corey or Alex is okay with me putting you in the group, then I'll put you in the group. Oop, or Corey or, or Alex can do it. Who, me? Okay. Yes. Okay, all right. Yeah, that's if you're aware foolish. <laughs> yeah. Uh, why did you do this? Just why, Michael boy? Yeah. Uh, how disappointing... Yes, happy late birthday, dads. Um, yeah. Uh, how disappointing it really is to see him do that. Exactly. Okay. Um. Okay. Um. Anything else we should honestly mention about what Michael Boyer's done? I don't really know, to be honest. I don't really know. If it, I think I think we actually mentioned everything to be honest. All right, so yeah, I guess I I guess I should end it anyway. We have mentioned enough. All right. Yeah, we have. All right. So, all right. well, so thank you all for joining me with this Arrowing right. Syndicate podcast made by me. We'll see you all in the next Arrowing Syndicate podcast. All right. Later on. So, yeah. Goodbye, everyone. Stay safe. Stay safe. Stay safe, you all. Safe travels. And, and have a Good nice day. Day. Goodbye, everyone. Sign it.